Cleveland's own Fox 8 News. Welcome back, everybody. The Fox 8i team has found a new way for law enforcement to find out if you are lying. And it can be used with or instead of the traditional polygraphs used for decades now. Fox 8's IT reporter Peggy Gallick shows us all about this, this high-tech tool here. Hi there, Peggy. <laughs> yes, it's really interesting. This new technology, you don't even have to say a word. The test can determine if you're lying by looking at your eyes. Peggy, I'd like to show you our new eye detect, lie detection technology. Just have a seat here. Bill Evans of Polytech in Akron explains that it just got harder than ever to hide those lying eyes. This technology, as you can see, law enforcement officials now have a new tool to tell if you are telling the truth. Eye detect. When a person is in a position they have to lie, the cognitive load is greatened to the point where the person then has to make a decision. Do I tell the truth? Do I lie? Do I tell the truth? Do I lie? And they finally make that decision. So they lie at that point, the pupil dilates. And eye detect picks that up. Well, it takes about 60 frames per second of your eye during the course of the test. This new technology can be used for pre-employment screening and it can also be used to catch a criminal. We also can examine on different types of crimes, right? sex offender testing. You're here to take a polygraph examination. I'm sure you're nervous, everyone is. Evans, who has been administrating the traditional lie detector test for over two decades, says eye detect is faster and easier to administer. The traditional ones can take two hours or more. Peggy, just put your chin in the chin rest. The person taking the eye detect test follows directions on a computer. The test takes about 30 minutes. Shortly after the test is done, the results are given to the person who administered the test. Well, Salt Lake City Police Department uses it extensively. Uh, in Ohio, we were the first to have it in Ohio. As a matter of fact, fourth in the country to have it. And so consequently now, I would imagine several police and fire departments will be using it in the future for screening purposes. Well, the results back to your department. Now, tests show I detect is 85% accurate on its own, and when used with a traditional polygraph, it's about 98% accurate. And because it's quicker and it's accurate, many agencies in Northeast Ohio are starting to take a look at this new device. Mm, very neat. Peggy, you are a bastion of honesty and, and credibility, <laughs> and yet you did not say whether you passed that test. Well, you too. know, it was really neat. They had one where I picked a number and you folded it up and then you took the test and would ask you, you know, you pick number five and mm -hmm. then, you know, lie. And it, boy, it, it got it, Lou. It, it picked got it, it up, okay. It, yeah, right. so it's it's really neat. I Very figured good. you did all right because you made it back to the station. <laughs> That's right, right. They, let, they let me go. <laughs> Thanks, Thanks. Thank you.